Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Autonauts. I think today we are going to work on, what is it, the door frames and window frames? That way we can get some tier 4 colonists all set up, at least their little shelters, their stone cottages. We're going to need a lot of these. So I think we want to get these producing right now, so that way we can look at the toy station while all these frames and window frames are being made. So let's see what it takes for that. Oh, did they just add that noise in a patch? Every time I hover over something, there's like a little thud noise now. Ooh, I don't know if I like that. Like I'm used to this high pitched like click noise, but I hear this really like deep little thud. Ooh, I don't know if I like that. Especially I think I hear it when I hover over anything else. Oh, yeah, they definitely added that. That sounds new. All right, hopefully that doesn't bug us too much. Can I turn that off, actually? Uh, settings, music, nope, sound effects, nope. Nope, nope, nope. Oh, I actually did want to increase autosave, so that way it's not glitching out the game all the time. Not glitching out the game, but, you know, freezing it. All right, all right, all right. So we want to, what, window frames, door frames, so let's just search frame. Door frame. Structural workbench, and what about window frame? That's probably the same thing as well. So two structural workbenches. Let's get those made. All right, logs, planks, poles, stones. So let's just throw these here. We are gonna need a flooring anyways. So let's go get stone, er, let's get fixing pegs on our way over. All right, we got tier four food being made. I really want that to stockpile up. So that is really good that that's going right now. All right, so let's see. Logs and planks should go here. Then we'll have to get the poles ourselves, the stone ourselves. All right, let's get the rest of the pegs. Oh, I don't know why they added that thud noise. Wait, they didn't do it to this. They just did it to like everything else. It has that little noise. Oof, I don't like it. I don't like it. They changed it. All right, let's get some stones. Oh, there we go, there we go. Alright, and what else do we need? Wait, didn't I add all the... I dropped the stone. Alright, I need a whole bunch of poles. Cool, cool, cool. So these window frames and door frames, if I remember correctly, are gonna take a buttload of panels and square frames. So hopefully our little log stockpile we got going on right now really helps mitigate how much our storage like depletes. I'm really hoping it doesn't drain us like we were about three episodes ago. All right, got two structural workbenches. Um, I think, you know, no, we have to keep these up here. We definitely have to keep this up north here so that way we're close to all the wood and things like that. Maybe we put it over here. Eh, we can put it down here. Wait, why is this complaining? There's... What? Oh, we didn't take all the flooring. Got it. All right, that goes there, that goes there. Let's see, frame. Door frame, window frame. I'm guessing those are just gonna store in crates. Let's see, yep, crate and door frame. Crates, all right. So let's get crates made. Boop, 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 boop. Should be in range. Oh, what the heck? Okay, so let's see. Let's shift that over a bit. All right. Let's see what it costs to make these frames. So it should only be two bots for these. Window frame, door frame. Ugh. Because it's so many different things, I don't know. We might need these bots to get a brain upgrade in order to handle these. Wow, they're almost the same exact recipe minus an additional square frame? Oh no, this uses poles instead of logs. Both use the same amount of panels. All right, let's get window frames done then. 
Window frame maker. Ooh. They changed some things around. The sure button's up here now instead of down here. Interesting, interesting. All right. All right, square frame. That's first. And what else? We need two panels. And panels, I don't think they can carry two panels at once. Yeah, definitely not. Oh my god, it's so slow. So heavy. I'm actually gonna stop it because I can just loop that. I don't need to record the whole thing getting a panel twice. Alrighty, then we need two poles, four fixing pegs. We might be able to do this without a bot brain. It's gonna be really close, actually. Actually, no, we'll probably be able to make it without a bot brain. It's whether or not we want collection to be handled with the same bot or not. That's gonna be the thing. All right, let's add these. Only need to do that once. Let's add the master loop. And then four fixing pegs. All right, let's stop that. Let's get our other four. Record again. Just add one. Stop that. All right, where are we at? Okay, let's throw all these in there. So what do we need? We need one square frame, which is that. We need two panels. So we have to do something like this. Two times, move to panel storage, take, add. We can't do, unfortunately we can't do move to panel storage, take two, just because they're too heavy. Then move to pull storage, we can take two here. So, to save, oh, we need a, we need a brain no matter what. Definitely need a brain no matter what, because we can do this to get two poles, but now we only have one kilobyte free left to, to do something like take four. Although we could do this, it's a lot of running back and forth though. And not only that, we don't have an extra kilobyte free in order to program the bot to stop producing frames if a storage is full. So let's get bot brain upgrade. Poles and tree seeds, easy enough. Uh, what, 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 what? What's dead? Something, oh no, our fertilizer guy's dead again. Oh no. Oh no, where's our, where's our cranker bot? There he is. Oh no. Our trees, that's such a bad time for our tree production to go down. No. Dung collector. I need you. Start collecting the dung. Yeah, that is so bad. No dung just instantly kills fertilizer, which instantly kills our s sapling production for trees. Oof, not good, not good. All right, let's move these crates. So, uh, crate there. Crate there. All right, well, we're gonna make two good bot brain upgrades. Luckily, we have plenty of seeds, so let, we're fine with that. Where am I at? It's taking me so long. All right, eight poles. Not a huge deal. Oh, this bot's dead. Oh, he's cranking them. We're good. All right, give me some poles. All right, that's brain number one. Then we're gonna need a second one for door frame bot. We'll just leave that there for now. All right, they're back to planting. We're happy. Luckily our logs aren't exactly depleted or anything, so it's not a huge issue just yet. All right, last four. And we can take these brains over to our guys. I have, yeah, that's him right there. All right, take both of these, shove one in him. I wish you could stack these upgrades. 
Fortunately, game doesn't lie. So we got an extra, extra eight kilobytes here. So let's do this. So we're gonna move, we're gonna take four pegs. Then we're gonna add until hands are empty. So that'll speed that up. Uh, let's do the same with this. We're gonna take two poles. Then we're gonna add both poles. That should be good. We have to keep the panels there because we can only carry one at a time. And then we can do the whole thing in a giant loop to do until this is full. And then we can also, ooh, not quite, not quite. I was gonna say we could also pick this up and deposit. Oh wow, we actually do have just enough. Nice. Nice, 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 we're good. Whoa, 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 what'd I do? Wait, find nearest, move to it, pick it up, move add, there we go. That would've mucked up the works. Oh, wrong way. I really wish I could just shift click this, but that does not seem to work. All right, now we throw all that until that's full. And that should be good to go. That should be able to make all those frames. All right, how much the square frame? I think we can carry two square frames at once. Square frame is, yeah, it's two, two hand spaces. What was the other one, panel? I'm pretty sure a panel's four. Yeah, panel's four and these bots can only hold six at a time. All right, so we need this bot. Door frame maker. All right, record, what do you need first? You need square frame, actually, Let's get the bot brain in place first. There we go, 28 kilobytes free. All right, two square frames. Yeah, our logs and our planks are gonna go downhill from doing this really, really, really quick. All right, add, add, two panels. the longest part because these are so incredibly heavy. I think there's also an upgrade to increase the amount they can carry. We could also add that to these bots because as long as it gives them two additional like hand strength or hand slots, that should be good enough to then loop the panels, but I don't know if it's worth it. Like we got it working. Maybe we shouldn't mess with it if we don't have to. Ooh, two logs. Luckily, these bots can carry two logs. Logs, I believe, take three spaces. And, and I see these bots carrying two logs all the time. All right, let's go get our logs and then our fixing pegs. Unfortunately, I can only carry one log. I don't think there's a way to increase my carry capacity. I wish there was, but there's not. Not that I know of. As far as I know, there's only the backpack and the scooter upgrade. Although there's gotta be two more things, cause why else would these be here? Maybe there is something. Maybe we didn't unlock it yet. Maybe that's it. All right, get this other log. And then we can get off fix some pigs. As soon as I deliver this log, it's so heavy. All right, record. Get these fixing packs. Oop, get rid of that. Don't need to record all four. We can go down here, record depositing one. Deposit the rest. Let me pick this up, throw it in there. Loop it. Loop it again until this storage is full. Let's throw all these in there before we start adding more loops. Five kilobytes left. I don't know if this rest, oh! I don't know if the, oh my God, I just almost deleted everything. I don't know if this bot has enough memory to do all this. Five kilobytes is cutting it close. All right, move to square frame. We want to take two. Right. Yeah, we want to take two. And then until hands are empty. 
Move to panel storage. We want to do this part twice. Uh, logs we could do until hands full. Oh, move to fixing pack. We need to take four. I know we need to do that. And we need to do until hands are empty. So there's the problem now. We don't, we need one more loop to handle the logs. Although we could, maybe we just have them work extra there, like do an extra trip there. So that'll free this up. And unfortunately they're gonna have to do an extra trip here. Log, move to log storage, take, add. So they're gonna have to walk back and forth for the square frames, the panels, and the logs, unfortunately. The pegs we can take all four at once. When we find the frame, we throw it in there. Yeah, that's gonna have to do. So let's let's walk through this. So do it until this is full. We're gonna go to square frame, take it, move to the workbench, add it. We're gonna do that twice to add both frames. We're gonna go to panel storage, take a panel, add it to the workbench. We're gonna do that twice to get both panels. Same thing with the logs. And then for fixing pegs, we're gonna move to storage, take four pegs, move to the workbench, deposit all four, find the completed frame, move to it, pick it up, add it to storage. All right, that should be good. So they're gonna start knocking out window frames and door frames. And actually let's get our Stone Cottage complete just to see if this is the final step. I hope it's the final step. It should be the final step. Oh my God, it's two window frames. Please tell me that's it. Does this need flooring now too? Oh my God, it's done, finally. It's finally, finally done. I think at this point, oh, our water's gonna go downhill because these guys are all dead. Let's take this baby, let's throw it in tier four just so we know what we need. Hey, Colonist Evolve, tier four. Nice. Nice, level four at leisure. Colonists now give one times 1,000 if you meet their needs. That's probably not gonna happen on this episode for sure. All right, who's the cranker bot over here? That's gotta be you. Nope. It's not you. Cranker bot, cranker bot Joey. Oh, that's a new sound too. It looks like they added a bunch of little sound effects here and there. I like that little water noise. Still not a fan of this thumping. Still not a fan of that thump. That's a big baby. All right, so we have clothing. Although why does that clothing have like a number three next to it? Not too sure what that means. The bar is blue, that's all that matters really. So we can take care of food there. So now we need to take care of toys. Let's see, toys, toys, toys. Toy station. Okay, let's get this made before all these square panels and frames go bye-bye. Square frames, panels, planks. Yeah, panels, panels are just gonna disappear. And unfortunately, that means our logs are just gonna take a beating right now. All right, four square frames. And four planks. Let's just pick up ones that are laying around. All right, toy station. Hopefully this isn't crazy to make some toys. Oh, flooring, easy. Easy, easy, easy. Let's just add that flooring there, that flooring there. Now we drag this up, right, right about there. Oh, it needs a wall, are you kidding me? Um, do we just throw it in some walls? Do we have walls? Please tell me we have walls, we have walls. Nice. No, 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 don't walk up there, walk down there. All right, let's take these walls. We're just gonna enclose this in a tiny, tiny, tiny little structure. Oh, let's get a doorway made. A little dry stone archway. I'm pretty sure that handles, right? Is that what I did with the kitchen? Yeah, that is what I did. So that should definitely handle that. Counts as a wall. Ooh. Oh no, we're short. We're short. Oh no. Are we out of stone? Why, why do you not? He wasn't working on these for some reason. All right, do I have any more stone walls? I don't think I do. I don't think I do. 
Oh, wow, we're out of stone? What are we using all our stone for? Where's this guy going with his, like, eight stone? Oh. Fireplace and chimney. Got it. Got it, got it, got it. It might almost be worth it for us to get two wheelbarrow guys going in and out of this. Like, if one can come and go, if we could time it right, so that they're coming and going in between each other, that will probably be really good. Um, I need some stone, please. Actually, we got a wall here. Wall, wall, wall. All right. And let's, I think this is the archway. Let's move it closer so he does that first. I'm really curious what the toy station is going to make. I'm guessing it's going to need, maybe it's going to need this bull rush. It's probably going to need a string. I'm guessing it's going to need string if I'm making like a doll. Like the string would be like the thread. I can't imagine what else it's going to need. Oh boy. Let's go check. Pole, stone, wool blanket, wooden buttons. Buttons are probably easy. Stone and poles, no problem. Wool blanket, which we have a ton of fleece, so that's actually good. Wool blanket, thread, button, straw. Thread is bulrush. So I guess the question is for this, do you want to put more of a strain on your wood supply and stone, or do you want to put more of a strain on bulrush and straw? Probably bulrush and straw. Since right now we don't have a use for bulrush. But we do have uses for poles and stone. So if I could avoid using those, it will probably be for the best. How do we get wooden buttons? Wooden buttons. Wood shaping bench. What are you? We're just learning all the new toys today. Oh, Lord. Okay, we gotta get this made before the square frames go. Bye-bye! Are there any other dead bots? There are. Oh, he's cranking them. Cool. We're good. We're good. We're good. Square frame. Square frame. Crankage. Wait, where's my crank? I thought I had a crank. Oh, there it is. Crank. Poles. Crude blade. Six planks? What? All right, two more planks then. What was it, two poles? Yeah, two poles. It's not terrible. Not a terrible recipe. All right, need more flooring, which we have, luckily. Ooh, just enough. All right, does this need walls too? You're gonna tell me you need walls, don't you? Oh, you don't, cool. I could have probably left this up there. Probably could have left that up there. This for sure is probably, probably, wait, do we already have a wood shaping bench? Oh, we do, we've used those before. But this recipe is probably gonna take two bots. My guess, wooden buttons. Oh, that's just fixing pegs? Oh, easy. Easy, easy, easy. I'm just gonna assume it's crates. All right. And actually, I think we keep this up north too. There's no reason to keep that right there. Oh my God, everything is getting so incredibly compact. Uh, let's move this down here near our colonist. Oh my god, there's just wolves sitting there. And actually, how do plush ponies get stored? Probably crates as well. Yep, so let's get another set of crates made. And then we were gonna program, program, where'd it go? There it is. This to make buttons, and we could just do that right here. All right, so this is gonna be super simple. Wooden button maker. All right, super simple. Take a fixing peg. Go add it over here. And we'll do until hands are full. Like, we'll just knock out storage for buttons. 
I'm guessing this crate though is gonna hold like 400 buttons. There we go. Loop it. And we'll do until something is full. That storage isn't ready yet. And we'll do until hands are full. And then until hands are empty. Oh, cool. Our storage is actually done. Never mind. Alrighty, and now you gotta watch me pick it up. Throw it in there. Oh, uh, let's see, how do we get... So that only made one. Actually, that works out really well. So if we add six, then we know we're gonna get six out. Cool. So then we can do that, and we can do find nearest. We can do until hands are full. Move the storage. Add all six. That should work. And this takes a hundred. Okay. Just go for that. Start making buttons. All right, so buttons are being made. Let's see, where's this at? Buttons are being made. Thread, I think we were making. Where did I do that though? I could have sworn I was making thread. But where? Where was I making thread? I know I was making thread because I was using bulrush and string like crazy or something. String, here it is. Oh, I was making string. I wasn't making thread. Aha. Aha. Thread, we need a spinning wheel. Which, we have one here. Oh, is this not doing anything? We have a spinning wheel here making cotton thread. Oh. So this makes wool. That makes thread. Wait, why did that wool look different though? Wool blanket, aha. So we're gonna need two spinning wheels because wool blanket's probably gonna take like multiple wool. Wool blanket. Takes one wool on a Kruth clothing station. So we need another clothing station. We also need another spinning wheel. So spinning wheel. I think we actually get a separate area and move this near the toy station just so it's all confined. Like everything that's together, like keep it in the same building since this cotton's going into tunics, which is then going like it's getting converted down the line. Keep it on the same building. I think we do the same thing. Everything that is made for the plush ponies, we probably keep in the same building as well. Actually, maybe I should put the buttons over there then. Well, to do that though, we're gonna need more stone. So let's actually reprogram, not reprogram, but get another bot to do this. Okay, until stone storage falls. So let's get another wheelbarrow real quick. Please, oh my god, two square frames. Can we do that? Oh, we're almost out, we're almost out, we're almost out. We need square frames. We need those, we need those. No, 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 no. Two square frames, all right. We got everything else, we're good with that. One crude axle. One crude wheel. And then what else? Two poles. Cause yeah, we're, we have stone in this wheelbarrow, which is really nice, but unfortunately the thing holding us back with stone is just the walking distance they have to go to get all that stone. So let's program another bot. All right, so this bot. Uh, let's see. Wheelbarrow. Oh, what did I call the other one? What did I call the other one? Is it miners? Mining, stone, wheelbarrow, okay. Stone, wheelbarrow, two, perfect. All right, so you're gonna need an engage. So I need to leave that there just so I can trigger it once and then I'll end up deleting that. 
So you need to head out to... Oh, we gotta wait till this for this to move. You know what? Let's just head out there now. Let's just head out there now. And then we end up going right here, I believe. 230 by 136. I think is where we go. I swear to God, if I don't take the path, I'm going to be upset. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, dead bots? Hey, he's getting charged. He's fine. He's fine. All right. As soon as that's full. All right. Now we could go here. So I believe they should just start adding to this, right? Or not? Wait, what's going on here? Stone Collector, why aren't you doing anything? Uh. Hold on, hold on here. Wait, Stone Collector, why were you only... Until hands are empty. I think I need to add some escapes here. I think something wasn't triggering in there. Okay, and what space is this? 264 by 50... 265? Okay, is this full? All right, that card's coming back. Hurry up. Oh no. No, he's coming. Oh God. Hurry up. Add him, add him, add him, add him. All right, we're gone. Is there a reason this isn't? This like isn't recording me. What is going on? Click record to edit. Oh, it's cause I was moving. Here we go. There we go. There we go. All right, so this should do. Now they'll take that. So I'm gonna have to fudge this a bit to get this to work properly the first time. Oh crap. All right, he's still taking from it. We're good, we're good. All right, so that's all we need. So now what we could do, we can wheel this all the way back. Oh yeah, they changed this noise too if I left click. It's like a little bubble popping. All right, so we're just getting back out here. And actually, we're gonna disengage this cart ourselves. Let's disengage that. And now we need to record this just going here. No, I want, why can't I get the... I don't know if this is recording. Like when it says move to crude road, like how does it know which, which crude road? All right, I do need two weights. And then we need to go to 230 by 136? Yeah, 230 by 136. We'll get rid of all of these. So then it should be that. Wait, what? No, the card's back. All right, so what it's gonna be though is like this. So we're gonna engage it once and then we're gonna delete that. Then forever we're gonna do until this is full. We wait, then we move, then we do until this is empty. We wait, 
And then we're gonna move here to this crude road, like this is currently waiting for. Come on, just add them. Add the last six. Beautiful. And that should be good. Now we just need to edit this part. Let's edit this area. So we just need him to engage this once. All right, so it should go engage this. Cool, then we can stop it. Now we can delete that. And now we should just be able to enable that. And that should be good to go. So now he'll just sit here and wait until that wheelbarrow is full. See if it works. Although, yeah, the stone collector's going, so that's good. All right, all right, all right. What are we at? We're at six, so this will get us the 12. He's collecting incredibly slow. I think that other wheelbarrow is gonna be on his way back. Oh boy. But this should be good to go. They shouldn't overlap all that much. And even if they do, they wait until they're empty or full. So, I mean, they'll just occupy the same space, I guess. Okay, so now I should just throw these two in. Now he should go down. We gotta watch one full cycle to make sure this works right. Okay, since that's going, let's check this one. Yeah, so it's the same thing. Until storage is full, we wait. Then we move down south, wait until storage is empty, and then we move back. Cool. And let's watch this bot. I really wish you could click bots while they're moving. Because I want to click them. All right. So now I should wait until that's empty. All right, take that last one and then the cart should go immediately back. And let's see where it stops because Crude Road doesn't really tell me much. Like he could stop on this very first track. I hope he doesn't. Nope, he's going back. So there's probably behind the scenes an actual coordinate buried within this little programming. We unfortunately can't see it. All right, and then we should stop right around here. Yep, perfect. All right, now we got double stone collection going on. All right, let's add these to the miners. Let's also get rid of, I just saw a random team here. Let's get rid of this team. All righty, I think that is a good stopping point. So we unlocked tier four colonists today. We got the stone cottage built. We also got the toy station built, and we have window frames and door frames being produced in mass. Although, it's gonna take a bit. We only have 12 and eight, and we are probably all out of square frames. Yes, we are. Yeah, what are we even waiting on with square frames? Fixing pegs. Oh, we're out of fixing pegs. Probably because we're making all these buttons, right? Yep. All right, so all this is gonna start working and catching up, but in the meantime, on the next episode, we can work on getting these plush ponies made. But until then, take it easy, everyone.